All right, when you're doing uh, a board that doesn't quite fit, we're gonna butt this one up all the way against the wall, pull this over, butt it up against this wall, and then mark your 45 where it's gonna go. I did it close to this end, so we'll cut off this little bit right here, and then that way we can save the length of this in case we need it for something else. Bam, good to go. All right, so if you don't get your board totally uh, square when you cut it, then you end up with a gap on the bottom. So we're gonna go cut that one again. Again, you wanna get it tacked in. Don't jam this thing in there, just fill that with caulk. We didn't even try to check it out. <laughs> it's pretty much perfectly flush. <laughs> That's exciting. So what we did is uh, this piece of wood was bowed. And so this side was falling down. So we got those in nice and tight and we picked up on this end and shot in the nails. This is some progress. It does feel quite a bit nicer just with that on there. <laughs> it's coming soon. So you typically don't have to measure very often. In fact, it's better if you don't measure. Just get your one end up there, butt it in nice and close, hold this here, and then just scribe your mark. It's oftentimes more accurate. You gotta be kidding me, look at this. I don't think I cut this one. Maybe I did cut it. I don't think I cut it though. Let's see if it fits. Oh, we're close. Oh, we're so close. Let's, let's make it happen. A little cock in that corner. You won't even notice. Now oh, check this out. We got close. You gotta try and minimize the amount of trips that you walk. You can, I think I'm sweating a little bit. Yikes. All right, just a bit too short. Let's check out that gross drywall texture. You know why I left it there? Because <laughs> it makes me happy. Check this out. So smooth. Makes me happy. All right, now what we'll do is we'll use this piece. We measured that for over here. Now we'll do the same thing for this other side. That way we're using up the entire piece of wood.
out real quick. Back there. There's a pipe. It was sticking out so far. Look at this. Why is it sticking out so far? See this? There's a huge box around this thing with the pipe right there. And then this thing didn't even line up to the ceiling. All right, just about done. We can call it a day. All right, so next steps, we gotta get vertical pieces on here. Like that, cut them off, call it good. Yeah, we did a wide bottom ledge, skinny top edge. Let me show you one thing real quick. So we're going to measure each of these up to here. You can do your line. You give it a crow's foot. So that means that we're going to cut on this side of the line. So we're going to keep the line right here and then cut this side off. If you cut in the middle or you cut on this side or you cut on this side, it's too short, too long. So make your little mark just like that. 